My report concludes that the accident to XV230 was avoidable and that XV230 was lost because of a systemic breach of the military covenant brought about by significant failures on the part of the MOD, BAE Systems, and Kinetic. This must not be allowed to happen again. My report identifies manifold shortcomings in the UK military airworthiness and in-service support regime and reveals matters which are as surprising as they are disturbing. The wholesale failure of all three organizations involved in the Nimrod safety case to do their job and the apparently inexorable deterioration in the safety and airworthiness regime in the MOD in the period 1998 to 2006 are particularly troubling aspects of the Nimrod XV230 story. There has been a yawning gap between the appearance and reality of safety. The system has not been fit for purpose.